they are getting forced to do something that no kid has ever done before. It is not in any way normal for kids to do cave diving at age 11. They are diving in something that is considered extremely hazardous environment, in zero visibility. Uh, the only light that is in there is the torches and uh, lights we bring yourself. So we were obviously very afraid of, of any kind of panic uh, from the divers. Then there is multiple equipment malfunctions you can imagine. Uh, so we had a contingency plan for if this breaks, okay, what are we going to do? We're going to do this. What if this breaks? Then we have this one as a backup and so on and so forth. Uh, I, I cannot understand how, how cool these small kids are, you know, and thinking about their being kept in, 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 a, in a small cave for, for two weeks. They haven't seen their mom. Uh, incredibly uh, strong kids. Uh, I, yeah, unbelievable, almost. What was your reaction when you saw the first one coming towards you? I was very scared because when I saw the, the diver and the, and the kid in the horizon, we can't see that far, but maybe about 50 meters, I still didn't know if it was a, if it was a casualty or if it was a kid. So I was, I, I was very scared. Yeah. It didn't feel good. But when I saw that, that he was alive and breathing and seemed to be all right, yeah, I, I, it, it felt very good. It felt very good, yeah.